Welcome back to our channel. Today we are covering Comp TIA Pen Test Plus PTO. To find the complete list of questions and answers, please go to the playlist link provided in the description. If you like this content, please like and subscribe to our channel. Today question is. A client wants a security assessment company to perform a penetration test against its hot site. The purpose of the test is to determine the effectiveness of the defenses that protect against disruptions to business continuity. Which of the following is the most important action to take before starting this type of assessment? Option A. Ensure the client has signed the SOW. Option B. Verify the client has granted network access to the hot site. Option C. Determine if the failover environment relies to, on resources not owned by the client. And Option D. Establish communication and escalation procedures with the client. And the correct answer is Option C. Next question is, performing a penetration test against an environment with SCADA devices brings additional safety risk because the option A, devices produce more heat and consume more power. Option B, devices are obsolete and are no longer available for replacement. Option C, Protocols are more difficult to understand. And option D, devices may cause physical world effects. And the correct answer is option C. Next question is, which of the following document is describes specific activities, deliverables and schedules for a penetration tester? Option A, NDA. Option B, MSA. Option C, SOW. And option D, MOU. And the correct answer is option C. Next question is, a company hired a penetration testing team to review the cyber physical systems in a manufacturing plant. The team immediately discovered the supervisory systems and PLCs are both connected to the company intranet. Which of the following assumptions, if made by the penetration testing team, is most likely to be valid? Option A. PLCs will not, not act upon commands injected over the network. Option B. Supervisors and controllers are on a separate virtual network by default. Option C. Controllers will not validate the origin of commands. And Option D. Supervisory systems will detect a malicious injection of code and command. And the correct answer is Option C. Moving to next question. A new security firm is onboarding its first client. The client only allowed testing over the weekend and needed the results Monday morning. However, the assessment team are not, was not able to access the environment as expected until Monday. Which of the following should the security company have acquired before the start of the assessment? Option A. A signed statement of work. Option B. The correct user accounts and associated passwords. Option C, the expected time frame of the assessment. And option D, the proper emergency contacts for the client. And the correct answer is option C. Next question is, a penetration tester has obtained a low privilege shell on a Windows server with a default configuration and now wants to explore the ability to exploit misconfigured service permissions. 
which of the following commands would help the tester start this process option r please go to the options and the correct answer is option b next question is hotspot you are a security analyst tasked with hardening of web server you have been given a list of http payloads that were flagged as malicious instructions given the following attack signatures determine the attack type and then identify the associated remediation to prevent the attack in the future if at any time you would like to bring back the initial state of this simulation please go to the hot answer area and the correct answer is correct answer is option a next question is which of the following protocols or technologies would provide in transit confidentiality protection for emailing the final security assessment report option a s m i m e option b fps option c d n s s e c and option d a s2 and the correct answer is option a next question is the penetration tester recently completed a review of the security of a core network device within a corporate environment the key findings are as follows the following request was encrypted going to the network device get login http slash 1.1 please go through these key findings which of the following would be best to add to the recommendation sections of the final report choose two option a enforce enhanced password complexity requirements option b disable or upgrade sssh daemon option c disable at http slash 301 redirect configuration option d create an out of band network for management option e implement a better method for authentication and option f eliminate network management and control interfaces and the correct answer is option c and e moving to next question a penetration tester ran a ping a command during an unknown environment test and it returned a 1 to 8 ttl packet which of the following os would most likely return a packet of this type option a windows option b apple option c linux and option d android and the correct answer is option a next question is a penetration tester who is doing a company requested assessment would like to send traffic to another system using double tagging which of the following techniques would best accomplish this goal option a rfid cloning option b rfid tagging option c meta tagging and option d tag nesting and the correct answer is option c next question is you are a penetration tester running port scans on a server instructions part 1 given the output construct 
construct the command that was used to generate this output from the available options. Part 2. Once the command is appropriately constructed, use the given output to identify the potential attack vectors that should be investigated further. If at any time you would like to bring back the initial state of the simulation, please click and reset all buttons. Go through the pictures. And the correct answer is A. Thank you.